Well, hi there. I'm Michael Hausam of the Hausam Group at Vista Pacific Realty. This is the Orange County Real Estate Marketplace update for the week ending August 31st. So I think we can now call it. This year is not going to be like last year with inventory and expected marketing time continuing out through the rest of the year. In the last couple weeks, we've seen demand come down a little bit. We've seen supply come down a little bit and expected marketing time is exactly equal. Let's first take a look at demand, which is pending sales from the last 30 days. Note that it is falling like it almost always does at this time of year. But also note that it's higher than last year, albeit lower than the previous two. Here's the key. With demand dropping, sellers are very unlikely to see any big price jumps or any price jumps at all. But notice on the supply side, these numbers are dropping too. Look at the green line from last year. The numbers kept increasing into November. That drove expected marketing time way up, and that's definitely not going to be happening this year. Even though there's still more inventory than in years past, the drop recently means that buyers are less likely to see any price drops either. So demand is dropping, inventory is dropping, and that means prices are pretty much going to remain unchanged. The biggest contributor to that for this year, of course, is interest rates. Last summer and fall, interest rates kept doing this, just like the market supply did, but this year they've dropped. Let's take a look at price ranges and see what's been happening in those specific areas. Under 750,000, expected marketing time dropped from 62 to 57 days. It's a slightly stronger seller's market in this price range than it was two weeks ago. Between 750 and a million, there's almost no change. 74 days expected marketing time. It's still a seller's market, but not that much different than the last couple of weeks. Between a million and a million and a quarter, it's a balanced market, but almost into buyer's market territory. Between a million and a quarter and a million and a half, it's a buyer's market almost completely unchanged. Now between a million and a half and two million, expected marketing time dropped almost 80 points from 240 down to 162. Now it's still a buyer's market, but way less so than it was before. Above $2 million, not that big of a change all around. It's still very much a strong buyer's market above $2 million, especially more so as you increase in price. So let's look at a few specific cities and see what's happening there. And you're gonna notice some cities have far more going on than others do. In Costa Mesa, right now, it's a seller's market with 72 days expected marketing time, down six two weeks ago from 78. It's about the same as last year's 71 days on the market, but way up from two years ago when it was 56 days. Right now, homes in Costa Mesa are selling at 98.4% of their asking price. In Dana Point, it's a buyer's market, 190 days, which is actually up from 184 days two weeks ago. A year ago, it was a balanced market, 106 days, and two years ago, it was at 129 days. Right now in Dana Point, homes are selling at 96.5% of their asking price. Huntington Beach is still a seller's market, 66 days expected marketing time, which is down just three days from 69 two weeks ago identical to the 66 days a year ago, but not quite as strong for sellers as it was at 55 days the year before that. Homes in Huntington right now are selling at 98.3% of their asking price. In Ladera Ranch, things have been all over the place recently. 104 days expected marketing time right now, which is a balanced market, which is a 26 point jump from where it was as a seller's market two weeks ago. A year ago in Ladera, it was a balanced market at 96 days. The year before that, balanced market at 91 days. Homes in Ladera right now are selling at 98.9% .9 of their asking price. Now in Newport, it's still a buyer's market, 
but expected marketing time dropped 20 days over the last two weeks from 224 down to 204. And that is quite a jump up from last year where things were at 175 days expected marketing time. Note this, two years ago, it was a balanced market in Newport at 111 days. That means right now it's taking almost twice as long to sell a house in Newport as it did two years ago. As a result, homes in Newport are selling at 96% of their asking price. If you'd like more information on a different city, please let me know because <laughs> I have all that info on every single city in the county. Furthermore, if you'd like to hear my strategies and my systems for helping buyers and sellers, please contact me. My number is 949-413-2371 and my email address is michael at housemgroup.com. Thank you so much and have a great day.